welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Okay. Our beloved Gallo region is a wonderful place of thriving with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon in which we share our lives. Oh my goodness, how do I keep getting signed into my Twitch account every day? As you know, our society is able to thrive! One, two, five. Oh. So yeah, I'm trying to change my game from COD. See in the sky and even! In all towns. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, we call Pokemon Trainers. When the crowd goes wild. Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose and it's a pleasure to be here. Now, turn your gaze into the Gala region's greatest Pokemon trainer. Your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's Exhibition Match. That's my last name. Okay. Oh, he's got a Charizard. Baller. They're throwing up gang signs in the crowd. I'm not sure how to feel about it. Exhibition or not, Leon, your pristine record is about to end. You know I don't lose battles, Rayhan. Charizard, Dynamax. Okay, he is a Dynamax Charizard. That was interesting. That was a very interesting introduction. Do I get... Oh, Come here! Mirror! Mirror! Oh, he's sitting at home playing his Switch. How cool! Is your big guy's name Leon? The master trainer guy? You didn't read it. I was like, they were like, Trainer Leon. I was like, wait, I was like, I don't remember putting it in my last name. So Dynamax is the form when they get really big. And I have a code for Dynamax crystals. Does that mean I get a Dynamax Pokemon? Well, how do I get a Dynamax crystal? I assume you're much further into this. Yeah. That's your that's your new flash phone. Your that's your flash new phone. You're watching Lee's exhibition on it, but you can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know the only way to properly cheer Leon would be to with his famous Charizard pose. Don't make me pose like a Charizard. Hello, chat member. How are you doing this evening? Uh, Hop didn't expect to see here today. This is the weirdest Pokemon intro ever. That's exactly why I came running over to get you, Zach. Never mind. Watching the match now. I've got it on it recording at home anyway. I'll record all my brother's matches. Come with me, Zach. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits. So, I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. I've got to run. See you at mine later.
Can I get up? Oh, this is so weird. I've never seen a Pokemon game. Oh, oh it's a it's a Munchlax. Hi, Munchlax. What are we doing here? Okay. Can I go through here? I'm just in the guy move kind of fast. She's tall. Is this my mom? Oh, it is mum. It's mum, not mom. Rushing off in that state, Zank? Didn't Hop say that you should bring your bag? I last saw it in your room. Don't forget to grab a hat for the weather. Come on, where's my room? How do I get to my room? Okay, how do I get to my room? Room, 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 room. Is it this way? Why is my... This house is weird. It's the weirdest house I've ever seen. I grab my dad's old bag. Oh, okay. It's a big bag. I don't think I want to carry that. I've got the beanie on, yo. Yeah, you got the little side flick for extra swag. Open the menu by pressing the X button. Okay, cool. Let's go. Let me into the world. Let me into the world of Pokemon. Let's do it. Hop is waiting for you. Why is somebody named Hop? Chet, this has to be the weirdest thing ever, playing Pokemon with a controller on a screen in front of me. Beyond weird. Dude, there's Pokemon everywhere. That's kind of cool. Yeah, Chet, look at all the Pokemon. There's a Butterfree out there. There's some of those uh, sheep Pokemans. These are those holding them in my brain, even it's as big as a Snorlax. Alright, hop, let's go. That sheep just ran into the gate like an idiot. It's a Wooloo. <laughs> this is kind of entertaining. <laughs> Don't go using tackle on the fencing. <laughs> In the slumbering wield. Me. Okay. Now that that's taken care of, how about it, Zach? Let's race. Bet I can make it to my house first. What with you lugging that big old bag? I don't know why I grabbed this big bag. Is there another bag for me to grab? Okay, can I go out here with the Wooloo? So it's weird, like, are these tame Pokemon? Why are there Wooloos everywhere? This is like the most popular, this is like a Pokemon battle stage? Is that what this is? Do we battle here? This house? This is so different. I hope this is his house, not some random lady's house. Mom, is he here? There you are, last hop. Oh, and you've brought along Zach. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, where's Lee? Have you got him crammed up in a cupboard? No, he's not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, hop, you must learn some patience. He probably only arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. Then that's where I'm going. You know Lee is hopeless with directions. I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Oh, you will? Yes, probably fits for the best. <laughs> Kevin, why are you saying ew, Kevin? You don't like Pokemon? Kevin, we're playing Star Wars later tonight. It's gonna be a long night, my guy. Can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. What are you ewing about, Kevin? What it do, baby? How was your day, man? So is his bro is Hop's brother the undefeated? I hate Pokemon. Why? Kevin, don't you ever say anything like that again. Is this is their grandma? Kevin, why do you hate Pokemon? Hmm. It's gonna move on. I only remember Zach. Wow, Pokemon can come out of nowhere. You walk through tall grass, patches of grass. I've got my Wooloo with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, of course. 
but not to use X, so we'll steer clear of tall grass as we go. Yeah, it never lets me go this far into the game without a Pokemon. Wild. Oh, I have a whistle. What happens if I run in here? Oh, they won't let me? Cool. Can I sprint? No? I feel like he's down here somewhere. We're looking for the undefeated trainer. There he is. Strike that pose. Hello, hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion Leon is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for all to watch. It's our unbeatable champion, Leon! You and Charizard are the greatest! Well, thank you for that. I hope you all carry on. You, you'll you all carry on training up in your Pokemon and never shy from the battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. We're on it! We've all been working to battle! Skills just like you taught us to, Lee! The Charizard is just too strong for the likes of us to take on. Why does he have... Brown facial hair and purple hair. Grrr. Lee, Lee, hop. So my number one fan in all the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo, that's the sort of sharp eye that's kept you undefeated so long, eh, Lee? These bright eyes over here, you got it. You must be Zack, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother, the Gala region's greatest Pokemon champion, and a massive Charizard fan, too. People call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on, Lee. And you, Zack. Bet I can beat both of you back home. Well, everyone, I bid you farewell today. But don't you fret, I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Gala can have a champion time. This dude's pretty cocky. Kind of want to beat him. So I'm going to meet him at the very beginning of the game, and I'm never going to see him again. That's what I've gathered. Greatest gift from the champion. It's showtime, everyone. Okay. Okay. Take a good look, you two. Ah, okay. The grass type, Grookey. The fire type, School Bunny. And the water type, Sobble. So they have the sad Pokemon and Sobble, which is really weird because they never have sad Pokemon. Which will you choose?
Chad, I really don't know. Chad, help me out here. Who do I pick? We've got Grookey. The score bunny is fire type. It's filled with bursting and fiery passion. You're set on a fire type score bunny? No, I'm not. Chad, I'm gonna be honest here. I'm torn between this guy and this guy. Like, I don't want Sobel. Boyer is picking Sobel. He's. Is there anything? Surely his water flows. No, we're not. Chad, help me out here. Which one? Fire grass. I think we're gonna go the grass type. We're going with Grookey. I do choose Grookey. I like to give Grookey a nickname. No, thank you. Now he's gonna beat the fire type. Yeah, he high fived me. We've already got a sweet handshake and everything. That's what I like to see. How sad are these other Pokemon? Like, what about the guy? Who, what about the one that doesn't get picked? Oh, score buddy didn't get picked. I feel so bad. I feel so bad now. He didn't get picked at all. Okay, I can get behind that. It's like picking a puppy at the shelter and leaving him behind. That's so sad. Day. Spent the whole night with a new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two getting on all right, understanding one another? Built up a bit of love. Of course I have, Lee. Zach's made fans friends with his Grookey, too. The fact that this guy's name is Leon is gonna throw me off the entire game. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourselves and your Pokeball. I can't wait to beat this guy. I really don't want to read any of this. Yes. What if I say no? If I'm like, no, I don't want to battle him. I'm just gonna go cuddle with my uh, my Grookey. Oh yeah, he picked the weaker one actually. Normally they pick the one that's stronger than you, so I'm gonna destroy it. Am I the grass type? This kid is so confident that I'm about to destroy him. You challenged my Pokemon train to hop! Get him, Grookey. He's sitting down just Wooloo! This is garbage. Do I have to battle both of his Pokemon? Okay, Grookey, Grookey is scratched, so we're gonna be scratching over and over again. A critical hit on his first one? That's whack. First Pokemon kill is down. I mean, knockout. Not kill. I would never kill another Pokemon. Ever. Ever. Chat, how's your guys' day going? Who's in the chat? One if you're in the chat right now. Who's here? Who's here? Let me hear it. It's not over yet. I've added another. It's a 2v1! I'm getting double teamed. 
It's Mia Khalifa, actually. Branch poke. <laughs> Branch poke. One. Hey, Kevin, you never told me why you hate Pokemon, yo. Do you like Star Wars, Kevin? Oh, yeah. Suck it, Sobble. Do you already know about type advantages? No, this is my first Pokemon game ever. Yes, I know about type advantages, you nub. It's because it's trash. Kevin, you have no these games. I don't like Star Wars either. Wow. You're toxic, Kevin. Toxic. Wow, he's leveled quick. So, uh, did you actually get every single one of those paint colors, by the way? You beat my two Pokemon. You and Grookey are too much. Well, that was a shock. Guess I know now why we thought he should give you a Pokemon, too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out Charizard and join in on the fun. Good effort out there, Grookey. Okay? Why don't you- why don't I get you all sorted? And Zach, you've got some real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a rival to hop, would you? Push him and make both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen me battle now, Lee. So come on, you've got to let me take on the Pokemon gyms. You join the gym challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Gala region? Not putting the cop before the rapid dash here, little brother. That's really what you want to do. You two have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend, Zack. I just kicked his butt! What are we talking about? Dude, I 2v1'd him! I clutched up round 11 style. Especially your friend, Zack, because you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than a collection of data, you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. Right, right, we get it. Pokedexes then. Look, like it looks like it's off to the Pokemon research lab for me and you, Zach. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champ. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokédex will mean nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. You probably better go tell your mom that we're heading out, though. Yeah, you probably better go tell your mom that we're about to head on a uh, forever long adventure. Oh, so this was his house. So my house. The Wooloo definitely just broke the gate, that's for sure. The gate's open. I hope Wooloo was there. <laughs> Into the vast region of the unknown. You don't think it actually broke through there, did you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once, and she came back in a real state, and that was compared to the earful she got from the professor afterwards. Zach, what do you say? We've got to save it. We're going in. Yeet. Yeah, yeet. Send it, right? Right? Even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to. Do what's needed. Hopefully, you're ready for anything. Because we're going in, Zach. Full send, huh? Are we going into a forest? Where do you think it got off to? Alright, well, that'll conclude our first ever Pokemon YouTube video here today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. For real though, this game is, uh, it's been a lot of fun. Uh, I like it. I've never played a Pokemon game quite like this. It's weird playing it on a console. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the first episode here. We'll see you guys back next time on Finding Wooloo.